The suitcase deadlift is a fantastic full body strength training exercise with so much real world carryover. So if you already have children, maybe a toddler or an infant, you're gonna constantly be picking things up off the ground with one hand. And you wanna make sure that you know how to do that safely. So it's a hip hinge motion. So it's not a squat down to the bell, it's a hinge. Now, Jessie's about 26 weeks along in pregnancy. This exercise is okay for her as long as she has what we call the hands-free mama feeling. So if she can do this exercise and she feels like she doesn't need to grasp her belly for support or pull it up and in, she's probably good. Um, as you get a little bit further along in pregnancy, you might run into some logistics issues with the belly running into the legs. And in that case, you might do a little bit more of a squatting down motion, but Jessie's gonna demonstrate the hinge. So to do the suitcase deadlift, she's gonna start with her feet about in line with her hip bones. She's gonna hinge her hips back towards the wall. If you kind of think about your sacrum, going towards the ceiling or right where the wall meets the ceiling she's going to keep her arms nice and in alignment she's not dropping either one of her shoulders she's going to grab the handle in the middle of the kettlebell and she's going to stand up by driving her feet through the floor she's going to reverse the motion to put it back down and pick it up again staying nice and stiff she's not rotating she's not flexing laterally or side bending good Perfect, and do one more, and then I'll have you turn to the side. Good, so turn to the side and show them what it looks like to put it down. So she's pushing her bum back towards the wall, thinking sacrum towards where the wall and the ceiling meet. Great, and this can also be done with double kettlebells. This is especially good if you don't have access to a trap bar for a trap bar deadlift, because it's essentially the same motion. So she's gonna chop at the hips, hinge her hips back towards the ceiling. Her knees are bent, but she's not actively bending them and dropping her bum towards the floor. <clears throat> good. Nice neutral spine, stand up for us, Jessie. She's not tucking her bum under at the top. She's not leaving it extended and pushing through her back. She's just staying nice and neutral. Perfect. And kettlebells are great for this exercise um, as opposed to dumbbells because they're a little bit higher off the ground. The dumbbell would be a little bit close to the ground. Um, and if that's still too much for you to be bending down that far further in pregnancy, you can always elevate them a little bit or if you were gonna pick up something a little bit closer to the ground, you could do more of a squat. So that's the suitcase deadlift, single arm and double arm.